everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video I'm going to show you how I created a fabric material with Soft and City Sampler and Adobe Firefly. With Adobe Firefly, you will be able to generate all kinds of fun patterns and shapes. For example, you can type in peonies and after playing with some of the settings, you will get some great results. For my fabric design, I went for the oriental style flower theme and I managed to generate these vector graphic style flower patterns. I think these are great for inspiration and a good base for further design work. After dropping all the images into Photoshop, I started chopping. I cut out all the flowers and elements I wanted to use and I created a composition from them. It's been a really fun experiment. You can also vectorize these elements if you want it out of Illustrator. I wanted to keep it rasterized, so I created the whole design in Photoshop. At the end I added a few tundras with matching colors and a few dots to make the design even more interesting and cohesive. When I was ready, I exported it as a JPEG. I will show you how easy that is to create a fabric material from this image. Open a new project in Sampler. The way I did it is I added a fabric material from the starter asset by dropping it onto the preview sphere in my viewport. You can just drop the JPEG into the viewport as well and it will appear in the layers panel. When you click on this layer, you can open the output usage drop down menu and you can select base color. As you can see, now we have a fabric material with our design. I like to add a bit of dirt to all my materials because it just adds a certain depth to it and makes it look more real. You can edit the properties of the base material if you prefer to change the roughness or other fabric settings. If you want to change the design, just uh, drag and drop another JPEG into the viewport and set it to base color just like the first image. It also works with uh, other image types, for example, PNG. This is the final design, now we can use it in 3D. I wanted to test my design on something that looks like furniture. This beanbag that comes with stager is just perfect for that. Just drag and drop it into the viewport from the start assets panel. When you go back to sampler, you can send this material to stager and it will appear on the model you selected. Now we can scale and rotate and work with it in many ways. After setting up a simple scene with some background and lights, I render the scene. I hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial. Check out my previous sampler and stage videos for more tips.